Genesis 1, 11. Vayomer Elohim tad she ha'aretz deshe esiv mazria zera etz peri ose peri lamino asher zaro vo al ha'aretz vayehi kain. Translation, then God said, let the earth produce vegetation, plants yielding seed, fruit trees bearing fruit according to its kind, which has its seed in itself upon the earth. And it was so. We start here with the call Vayiktol, 3MS, of Amar. God is the subject. He is speaking, and we have the content of his speech in most of the rest of the verse down to the Athnach. And he starts with the Hifil stem, and this is a hifil, vi, or a hifil yiktol. It's a 3FS. The subject is the earth, which is also a feminine singular noun. And the hifil gives us the idea of causative. And so it's that the earth is going to cause uh, something to happen here. Uh, it, this is from deshe. And you'll notice that the verb and the noun have the same root letters, that dalit sheen and olive and this is called a cognate accusative and when you have this you could translate it let the earth sprout sprouts or let it grass grass or something like that but a lot of uh, translators will just give it the idea of let it have this or let it produce this let it produce vegetation uh, might be how I would translate it here or let it produce grass and then we have um, plants with a participle here. Uh, this also is a cognate accusative from zerah, that's the, the word for seed. Here, what's it doing? It's going to be uh, producing or yielding seed. And this is also a hifil, so it's causing it to do this. And this is going to be a masculine singular participle from the root, which you see here, zerah, although you see that Hiric yod, uh, which gives us um, a, a distinguishing feature many times of the hifil stem. And then we have another participle. In this case, this is the, the call, just the simple participle from asa. And we see that right there, uh, that this is going to make or bear fruit. The fruit tree is going to bear fruit according or to uh, mean it to from it according to its kind is how we translate that and then we come down to our last clause of the verse uh, which we have the call vayiktol 3ms our formula we've seen quite a bit vayihikain and it was so